The ChoiceMed Finger Pulse Oximeter is used to measure heart rate and oxygen saturation in the blood. Our pulse oximeter comes complete with a neck lanyard, two AAA batteries, and a complete instruction manual. How does a pulse oximeter work? When using the pulse oximeter, make sure that your finger lines up with the red LED light. This red LED light emits two wavelengths that reflect differently depending on the oxygenation of the blood cells. The pulse oximeter obtains the ratio of oxygenated cells over deoxygenated cells to give you the SpO2 percentage. A normal SpO2 is typically above 95%. However, certain patients may have lower SpO2 depending on their condition. To begin with, remove the back cover of the pulse oximeter and insert the two provided AAA batteries. Press the power key to trigger the pulse oximeter and then insert your finger to start your reading. You'll notice that there are many variations of how the screen can be read. Upside down or right side up. This number here is your SpO2 reading. Typically, it's above 95%. This number here is your pulse rate. This shows how many times per minute your heart beats. The blue bar here fluctuates, giving you a visual representation of your heartbeat. Looking at the functionality of your pulse oximeter, tapping the power button will give you several different viewing angles of the readings. The blue waveform at the bottom of the meter is a visual representation of your heart rate over the last five seconds. By holding down on the power button, you can increase the brightness level of your pulse oximeter by up to 10 times. Inaccurate readings can be caused by too much movement, too much external light at the reading site, or poor circulation. Wearing nail polish does not affect the pulse oximeter reading. Always consult your doctor before and after the use of the pulse oximeter to discuss your health.